All right, so let's talk about repeating groups. Okay, so repeating group is a special kind of type of group in Bobble and it's used to display a list of things. Okay, so a group can show just one thing. So it may show one user with a certain email address and a repeating group may show all users. Okay, think of it like a table. Okay, a repeating group will just show all users. Uh, one group may show one user. Now we design how we want things to appear. So the repeating group can show in a table format or in a card format. Uh, it just depends. It's just the, the key thing is that uh, we define it once and tune parameters and then we can show uh, each thing is repeated in a different fashion. Okay, so it just renders in a grid. We control the rows, the columns and how uh, if the page shrinks or uh, shrinks or expands how uh, the, the repeating group looks like. Okay, so the data source property, that's what defines how it gets its data. Okay, and the layout defines how it appears and loads. Okay, is it four columns, uh, four rows, one column? Does it scroll, does it horizontally scroll? So repeating groups have lots of different knobs and we can just use it for a card layout, a table layout and many, many different types of layouts. Okay, so just as an example, uh, this is like a list of courses, the name of the course, the description of the course, the button start course. This is a repeating group. We decided we designed it once and configured it so that it's a vertically scrolling group. Uh, and it's just like a repeating group example. Okay, so uh, an actual live example is going to come soon uh, in one of the next videos where we can uh, create, read, update, delete things. Uh, so that's it for this one. Thank you very much. See you in the next video.